with post-processing tools, you're enhancing what's already there. And that could be the tone, colors, adjusting the exposure or the white balance. Every single photo needs some kind of processing just to bring it back to life. First thing we're gonna do is correct the composition. Crop in just to kind of remove those elements, just to tidy everything up. As a kind of starting point, I think that's pretty good. We're just gonna raise the exposure ever so slightly. Highlights, one of my tips is if you go all the way and then bring it back until it looks about right. And we're just gonna raise the shadows ever so slightly. Just lift the whites very subtle. Pull down the blacks just to add a bit more punch of the dark areas. Gonna add the basic kind of S curve just to enhance the image. So lift up here, pull down here. Minor changes, that looks about right to me. Now we're gonna go and do a little bit of work on the color, so let's jump in. We're gonna work on the yellow channel just to bring this through a bit more. We wanna pump the saturation to enhance what's already there. I would always encourage a light touch because it's it's quite easy to do too much. Now we're gonna move on to the yellows. Just gonna bring that down slightly, a bit more towards the kind of orange side. We've got a nice pop of the color. Now we're moving into Photoshop for the finishing touches before we export the image. We're going to pick the healing brush, so let's just give that a go. We don't need to do a huge area, it just needs to be that little mark there. Lightroom saves me a lot of time. It's that quick and easy. I'm loyal. <laughs> <laughs>